नमस्ते दिस इज द्रुवीन एंड इन दिस एपिसोड आई एम गोइंग टू टॉक अबाउट अपडेट वर्सेस अपडेट इफ फंक्शन इन डिटेल अपडेट एंड अपडेट इफ बोथ द फंक्शंस आर यूज्ड टू अपडेट द रिकॉर्ड इन द डेटा सोर्स बट व्हाट इज द डिफरेंस इन बिटवीन दोज टू लेट्स ट्राई टू अंडरस्टैंड दैट इन डेप्थ थ्रू आउट दिस सेशन But before that, if you haven't followed me on my Twitter and Instagram so far, please do follow me. So let's get started. Here I am on my machine, and here I have taken one collection where I am storing employee ID, first name, last name, department, and salary. These are the different ten records that are available in that collection. So I simply created a collection using clear collect function, and I have taken five columns over here. so this is the overall collection code now we know that update and update if both are used to update the record in the data source but let's try to understand here the clear difference so let's first talk about the update function so let's say for an example here i have one record called lisa and i want to update her record with some other name then how can i use update function over here let's talk about that so id number 6 i want to update here okay and for that we will use update function to use the update function simply use update function in update the first parameter is the name of the data source or collection which you want to update i want to update employees over here so let's provide that then you need to provide old record okay so here i want to update record number 6 okay so what i will simply use here is i will pass that entire record using lookup function lookup collection name employees and in that employees i want id equal to 6 employee id equal to 6 okay so i pass that entire record and then comma i want to pass the new value which value i want to update here so let's say i want the first name to be replaced instead of Lisa I want name Alia so I'm just using Alia over here then comma I want to update salary as well so instead of Lisa's salary 55000 I want 45000 over here okay and let's complete the bracket and let's format the text and let's see what will happen over here okay so we are taking Uh, we are updating employee id 6 and we are updating two columns first name and salary over here okay so let's click on that and let's see what happens so you can see that id number 6 is updated with alia and 45000 as salary but other values like employee id last name and department value become blank why because update function replaces the entire record it is not only updating specific value of the column okay so remember that thing so whenever you have a requirement to replace your entire record with the new record set at the time use the update function so you can see that the other column has the blank value okay so this is update now let's say if i write the same function with update if what happens let's have a look now what i will do here is simply i am initializing my collection again so i have the value as is and now let's use update if pick up the button and start typing the function update if in update if the first parameter is collection i am passing my employees condition here you can pass okay here i can simply plus employee id is equal to 6 and then item which value i want to apply as a update value so here i want to replace my first name with alia and salary with 45000 finish the bracket and let's see the syntax okay so this is how it looks like now let's click on the button and here we are you can see that the number 6 has been updated with alia and salary as 45000 right so update if does not replaces the entire record it updates only specific value from your data source okay so that is the first clear difference between the update and update if function okay now second important thing over here let's say for an example if you type a condition like this employee id greater than 6 so what it will do is 
विच एवर रेकॉर्ड विच हैज एम्प्लॉय आई डी ग्रेटर देन सिक्स इट विल अपडेट ऑल द रेकॉर्ड फर्स्ट नेम एज आलिया एंड सैलरी इज फोर्टी फाइव थाउजेंड सो इट इज अपडेटिंग द रेकॉर्ड इन बल्क बेस्ड ऑन द कंडीशन दैट यू हैव अप्लाइड सो लेट से आई एम क्लिकिंग ऑन अपडेट इफ ओके एंड आई एम सिंपली क्लिक ऑन दैट एंड यू कैन सी दैट ऑल द रेकॉर्ड हैज बीन डन ओवर हियर लाइक दिस वे वाइल इन केस ऑफ अपडेट इट ओनली रिप्लेसिस वन रेकॉर्ड एट अ टाइम इट्स नॉट समथिंग विच सपोर्ट्स लाइक इफ यू टाइप हियर ग्रेटर देन सिक्स देन यू विल गेट मल्टीपल रेकॉर्ड एंड मल्टीपल रेकॉर्ड विल अपडेटेड विद दैट इट इज नॉट पॉसिबल एट दिस मोमेंट ओके सो दैट्स द अनादर डिफरेंस बिटवीन अपडेट एंड अपडेट इफ नाउ वन मोर थिंग लेट से instead of employee id greater than 6 if you simply pass here true as your condition then what happen here is all the record from your data source is updated with the value that you have defined over here so if i clicking on this you can see that all the first name is replaced with alia and salary with 45000 right so that's all about the update if function so if i summarize the overall thing update function support one record update at a time it replace the entire record okay while in case of update if it only replaces specific value of the column of the record okay and it supports the multiple value updation together at a time okay so hope now you get a proper clarity about the update and update if function hope this video helps you and values your time if so please hit thumbs up and subscribe my channel it's free for you but it motivates me a lot are you looking for any training or consultation from me then website link is available over here send me your query over there and don't forget to subscribe my another channel digital dhruvin and don't forget to follow me on my twitter and instagram as well because i am uploading lots of short content over there with this this is dhruvin signing off see you in the next session with some amazing content till then have a great day goodbye